Hi guys, it's me Teacher Gorn. In our today's video, we will talk about this problem. What is 120 minus the 40 percent? So without further ado, let's do this topic. So we have here 120 minus 40 percent. So the normal natin ginagawa dito is that we will get first the 40 percent of 120, and then we will subtract that 40 percent from 120. So here's a trick on how to answer this kind of problem in an instant okay in an instant but you need to practice later on using different examples so let's try 120 percent 120 minus 40 percent so this is 40 percent and we will treat 120 or this given number 120 like 100 percent so we have now 100 percent which is 120 minus your 40 percent so what we need to do here is that we need to simplify this 100% minus 40% which is equal to 60%. So ito yung trick natin ngayon dito. We need to get the 60% of 120. And knowing that meron na tayong tinuro sa inyo, di ba? May, may shortcut na tayo on how to get the uh, percentage of a number when it comes to multiples of 10. So dito, ang gagawin lang natin is that we will cross out 1, 0, and another 0. So what we need to do is to multiply 6 and 12. So we need to multiply 6 and 12. 6 times 12, again, or 12 times 6, that is equal to how many? This is 12, carry 1, 6 times 1, which is 6 plus 1, that is 7. So we have now the answer of 72. Therefore, the 120, 120 minus 40% is equal to 72. So let's try this kind of trick using different problems. So let's have this one. We have here 60 minus 20%. So we can translate this one using our trick. Diba? This is 100% minus, minus 20%. So it will become 80% of 60. So what we need to do here is to eliminate your zero, your zero. Again, this is only applicable for those percentages with divisible by 10. So we have to multiply 8 and 6. So we have 8 times 6, which is equal to 48. Next, we have here 150 minus 40%. This is 100% minus 40, so we have now 60% of 150. So what we need to do here is that we will eliminate 1, 0, and 1, 0, multiply these numbers, 6 times 15, and 6 times 15 is what? Okay, you can multiply it on your own. 6 times 15 is equal to 90. Therefore, 150 minus 40 percent is equal to 90. Now let's continue. We have 50 plus, this is plus, huh? this is different from subtraction, 50 plus 120. So this is your 100 percent plus 20 percent. So we have now 120 percent of 50. Okay, so we need to eliminate 10, 10. So we will multiply 12 by 5. So we have now 12 times 5, which will give us the answer of 60. So again, 50 plus 20% is 60. Now, we have here the last problem, 40 plus 20%. This is your assignment. Please comment down below. What is your answer here? In the last problem i hope to see your answer in the comment sections so if you're new to my channel don't forget to like and subscribe but hit the bell button for you to be updated sa latest uploads again it's me teacher gone maraming maraming salamat bye